Hey YouTube, this is Primetime Pokemon. I have some free cards by mail to open up today. These ones came in a brown priority mailbox. I've already cut open the tape here, so it shouldn't be too hard to get the box open. Looks like there's a note on the inside saying who it's from. Looks like there's an empty tin in there, probably. Actually, it's even better than that. I thought it was a tin at first. Here is what the note says, and then I'll show everything on the inside. Okay. So it says, Dear Primetime Pokemon, Hello. I hope you are receiving this package well. I am a 20-something year old collector. I started collecting in 2015 and amassed a huge collection. I started collecting base set when it came out, but never had money to buy packs. Sounds pretty similar to my um, history in Pokemon card collecting. Now, with extra income, I'm back into collecting after randomly si seeing one of your videos on YouTube and being amazed by the beauty of the artwork on the recent Pokemon cards. I'm a huge fan of your How Much Are These Pokemon Cards Worth videos and have also started collecting sealed product and booster boxes. Thanks for all the tips and help with collecting. I am sending you some gifts as a thank you for all the hours of entertainment and help on my collecting journey. Feel free to show your face more in some of the future videos. I'm sure your fans would love to see that. Keep doing what you do and hope you have great poop polls. Also, hi mom. That's a pretty good one right there. Shout out to his mom. Totally kidding. Sincerely, Jane C. And then there's their YouTube channel there and they also sell it looks like Pokemon cards on eBay so you can check those two things out I'll have a link to the YouTube channel in the description of this video if I can find it moop it looks like is the YouTube name so I don't know how common that is but like I said pretty excited for the stuff that's on the inside quite a few things I can pull everything out that's in the bubble wrap here and right here is the reason I was pretty excited now as you can see it looks like two Jirachi Mythical Pokemon collection boxes. Now I'm currently doing a giveaway on YouTube that ends on April 30th for all three Mythical Pokemon collection boxes that have been released. I've opened up three already on YouTube, but wow, hopefully I get some great pulls in here. I didn't have very good pulls out of, I believe I didn't have great pulls out of this one, but it looks like three two boxes here something here a figurine looks like and then one card here so i'll save those mythical pokemon collection boxes for last cannot believe the generosity here i really have some great fans out there and i'm glad to have inspired any of those who started collecting because of my videos or just who watch my videos in general i know when i was younger like he mentioned wasn't able to afford many packs or anything but now that i'm a little older and working i can't afford things so a nice charizard figurine there pretty cool looking and then there's a card here and of course Charizard is my favorite Pokemon of all time Ooh, there's a nice card right there generations radiant collection subset Pikachu full art so that is a nice card right there very generous of James to send these cards and on to the best items in this box the two Jirachi mythical Pokemon collection boxes. Now, there are tons of great cards to pull in this out. I'm a huge fan of Generations. So as you can see, I'll actually just lift the camera up. Normally I don't do that, but there are the two boxes in this video. Very, very generous of James to send these boxes to me. Okay, so the way that you open these, once the redness gets away, there we go on the camera. The way that you'd open these is just on the side, and each of these boxes are $12.98 in stores. If you're buying from Walmart, $12.99 at stores like Target and whatnot. However, if you buy them online, surprisingly, some sites have these boxes for quite a bit of money. Now, for some reason, I cannot open these. I'm either really weak today, or these are glued really tightly. There we go. Each of these boxes, like I said, $12.99 in stores. Two Generations booster packs in each one plus a code card, black star promo, and pin. So I'll open this one and then open the next one separately. That way I'll give you a little break in between just opening items. But here is the pin. Same pin that's in every single Jirachi box. Same black star promo. So I don't have to show these in the second box, but here it is. XY112. 
Just very generous. Really can't believe my luck sometimes from my fans. And here is the code card. I give away code cards on my blog every single day. Okay, so two packs here. And the card trick's a little bit different in Generations packs. It's one, two, three. And the next three are the cards that you want to move to the back of the pack. So one, two, three. The next three are the second Radiant Collection card, the Reverse Hollow, and Rare. Okay, so first card here is a Rhyhorn. There's a Ponyta. Magikarp. Grass type energy. Pretty cool looking when they're in reverse hollow form. Esper, first radiant collection card. There's an Im Imakuni. I get a good laugh from this card every time. A famous Japanese person. Not really much uh, recognition in the US at all. There's a maintenance. Double colorless energy is the reverse hollow. Second radiant collection card is Meowstic. And the rare in the pack. A Dodrio non hollow. Now, I know a lot of people have had really good pulls out of Generations overall. It seems like it's really hit or miss. I've had a couple of decent, pretty good openings for Generations, but a lot of my openings have been pretty bad where I've been shut out overall. So, I'll see out of two mythical Pokemon collection boxes what my pulls are like. Okay, so second pack starts off with a Psychic type energy. There's a Diglett. Pikachu. Next up is Zubat, followed by a Snow Runt. Then there's a, an Olympia, Max Revive. There's a Diglett, and that is the Reverse Hollow Common card. And the second Radiant Collection card, Frostlass. That is an uncommon. Cool that it's a hollow foil here. This pattern reminds me a lot of the AR sub series from the Arceus set design. And the final card here, ooh, a Golem EX. So a great pull here. An excellent box overall. And just think, one more box to open up from this person. Hopefully I'll be a little bit stronger this time and be able to rip this box open a little bit quicker. Maybe I'll just bring it back here. There we go. Got this one open a little bit quicker. Like I said, same pin and Black Star promo card and code card. So I can give away another a code card here. So there's a Jirachi Full Art XY Series Black Star promo. Then here is the code card. And then here's the pin. And then the two booster packs on the inside. Blastoise and Charizard. I'd really like to pull a Mega Charizard out of one of these packs. So I'll set that aside. Start off with this Blastoise pack. See Meowth is on the front. Okay, one, two, three, one, two, three, and first card in the first pack here is a Meowth, followed by a Slowpoke. Next up is a Tangela, followed by Rhyhorn, Wobbuffet, there's a Persian, Golbat, Pokemon Center Lady, second Radiant Collection. Ooh, a Flareon EX. Now, it is possible to get two Ultra Rares in one pack. Never happened to me, actually. So, Flareon EX is the Radiant Collection subset card. And the final card. Oh, there we go. It did happen to me. A Vaporeon EX. So, two Ultra Rares in one pack. Wow, that is a great pull right there. I think that's only happened to me about three times in Legendary Treasures, once in Breakthrough, never in Breakpoint, and now one time in Generations. Okay, final pack here. We'll see what happens. Okay, final pack. Starts off with a Dark Dark Ride, Darkness Energy. There's a Krabby, Caterpie, Meowth, Gulpin. Revitalizer, red card, there is a Crushing Hammer, that is the Reverse Hollow, Radiant Collection card, ooh, a Mega Gardevoir EX, that is a nice card right there, and the final card, a Gyarados non Hollow. So amazing pulls overall out of those two Mythical Pokemon Collection boxes. Thank you very much to James or Moop for this free cards by mail package. Some amazing items here. I guess I can summarize the better pulls from the two Mythical Pokemon Collection boxes. We have this Mega Gardevoir EX, 
Flareon EX, Vaporeon EX, so a couple of EV evolutions, and then a Golem EX. So thanks everyone for watching. As always, before you go, check out all the links in the description of this video, including links to my blog, Facebook, and Twitter pages, as well as check out this person's YouTube channel. There'll be a link in the description, as well as a box on my channel featuring this person's channel for about a week after I upload this video to YouTube. So thanks again everyone for watching, and stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.